In today's quick tutorial, we're going to be going over how to set up an out of office email or an autoresponder email from your Gmail account. So to do this, you're first going to navigate up to your settings section and then click see all settings. As this new page opens, you're going to want to navigate to the general tab. It should already be here, but just in case it's not, make sure you get over to the general tab here and then you're going to scroll all the way to the bottom. Once you're at the bottom, you're going to be setting up what's known as your vacation responder. This is what you're going to be using for your out of office email. So this sends an automated reply to incoming messages. If a contact sends several messages, this automated message is only going to be sent once every four days. You can turn it on and off with this button. You can set up the first day and the last day. So if you just want to set it indefinitely and come in and click this on and off button, you can do so, or you can set it up on a timer. You're going to set up the subject. So you can say out of office or holiday cheer, whatever you want to say. And then you can say, I will be out of the office for the next four days. I will be out of office and back on Thursday. Just whatever you need to say to get your message across. You can say, I will be out of office and back on January 2nd to start the new year off with a bang. Whatever you need to say. It, you can set it up to only send a response to people in the contacts. If you're with a business, you can set it up to only send a response to people in your business, in my case, Blue Notary. And you can click save changes. That's the last thing you're going to need to do. And just like this, once you save the changes, it's going to say holiday cheer, you know, whatever you set your subject as and your vacation settings, this will be a banner on your Gmail. So you'll always know that this is what's going on just in case you ever log in and forget about it. And in my case, I'm just going to end it now just because I don't want it to. So if you found this tutorial, Useful, helpful. If you gain some insight from it, please follow along, like, and subscribe. We're going to have more business tutorials on the way.